So if you're using lined paper or blank paper, you're going to have to create the lines or finish them. So I'm just going to do a quick line, do a few of them. I'm just going over the blue lines on this paper because it's easier for you guys to see and easier for me to see. I'm not doing it exact, but you get the picture. I'm just going to do that much. And obviously I'm not using those ones or those ones unless I need to. Then what you need to do for the second step is, that was the first step by the way, for the second step you're going to need um, to think of your design. In this case, um, I'll do a house because that's all I can think of right now. And I'm not going to have the colors exact because I don't have all the colors for a house. And don't make fun of mine because it's probably not going to turn out great. But um, you watch this video for your advice not to make fun of people. So um, let's see. Uh, okay, what, you're, what I'm going to start with for this is brown. And I'm doing this all upside down because my camera is not facing me. So you're just gonna, it, it might not look so good on my side. Okay. There's brown. And you can take my pattern, I don't care. Give me credit if you want to. But this is really just a basic design. I didn't steal from anyone, I'm taking it up on the spot. And three at the top. Uh, if you have an eraser, you can probably erase. I'm gonna see if my eraser will work because actually, never mind. I'll just keep it. Make a window there. So <laughs> skip one there. Okay, so that's the door. Two up for a door. One up for a window. Uh. Up another. And mine's only a one, no, uh, two story. Why not make it a two story? So that's the bottom of that. That's the top of that. So then we'll have uh, another window there. So there, there, and there. And I wrote that upside down too. So then one for the top. And then um, I'll do peach for the door. I'll leave those ones white because I have white pearly beads. Um, then I have another brown. Hope this one's brighter. And I'll go there, there, there. It's not a very good design, but it's just quick. And if you take this one, I don't really care. I've already said that. I know that one, but um, yeah, this is just a thought of one. And sometimes when you iron it a lot, I'm um, just saying this for regular advice on pearly beads. Sometimes when you iron them a lot, the, even like the corners will fuse together and make a triangle shape. If not, then I think there's, uh, yeah, with some boards you can make triangles and stuff. You could just do that on one board and then triangle on another and put that on top. Anyway, so that's basically all you have to do to make the design. And then I don't have my pearl beads right now. They're somewhere hidden. But um, you can make this design out of pearl beads, and I will probably put that at the end of this video when I find them. It won't be iron though, because I don't really want to make this design in general. Well, uh, thanks for watching. I hope this video helped you guys that want to learn how to make this. And, well, bye!